Hey guys, we're up at Kristen's folks right now getting ready to uh, head down to Cross Ranch. Behind me is our good old Class B. We're still uh, kind of waiting to pick up here. Uh, Kristen's dad still got some stuff to do with it before he turns it over to us. But we uh, just had to stop up here to pick up a crock pot. We're gonna cook some roast up tonight. We're gonna be staying in a yurt at Cross Ranch, so we're gonna be going to Walmart, pick up some supplies, and then we'll be heading down there. So see you guys when we get there. On our way to Cross Ranch, and we have about 200 head of cattle that are uh, on the road here. They're trying to get them off the road. Okay, thanks. So we're going to follow this truck right here around these cows. Good thing nobody got in a wreck here because they just kind of all shot out right out all at once. And we're on the top of a hill here, so people coming from the other way. I don't know how they could have seen them, but we got a lot of cows right here. I don't know how well you guys can see. I'm gonna stick it out the window here, maybe you can see better. We're just gonna go through these guys. Still trying to get through the cows. Don't slip! Oh, now they're coming around everywhere. We're in the middle of a herd. All right, guys, well, we arrived at the yurt. Let's walk in and take a look at it. This particular yurt is called the Ice Glider. They got about four other yurts here. And right over there, if you can see, that's the cabin that we stayed in uh, on the last video, the cabin porn video. But anyways, let's go inside here and take a look. I just got done taking a shower. And walk in here. Kristen and the dogs are already in here. I'm gonna shut this door here. And pan around, let me brighten it up. And you walk in, do a circular motion here. And right here we got a fridge counter with some of our snacks got two bunk beds right there table right in the middle to eat and hang out at it's heated by a propane heat little type of uh, fake fireplace right there some more seating got lights and stuff in here and there's Kristen and the dogs Okay, that pulls into a bed too. And we also got a nice sunroof. Look at the stars tonight if it's clear enough. So yeah, just giving you a quick look at our yurt here. This is the ice glider once again. The ice glider yurt. This is named after an important culture site located in the northwest corner of the Cross Ranch Nature Preserve. There's a little plaque hanging out here in the yurt. Pretty neat. What you think, Nina? What are you thinking? Huh? Oh, excited? Yeah, you are. You are excited, aren't you? Yeah, excited for a tree? What was that word? A tree? What about this guy? A tree? Does this guy want a tree too? Looks like that tail's wagging for one too. Mm, tree style. In case anyone is interested in these exact yurts, there's a website on the side of it here, it's www.yurts.com. It looks like uh, this specific yurt comes from a company called Pacific Yurts Incorporated. But yeah, just uh, heads up if you're all interested for it.
Hey guys, I'm just kind of out here waiting for uh, the geese. There's a lot of geese out here, but I'm trying to wait for a specific picture. I want to get them flying over the yurt here. I've seen them fly a couple times throughout the day, but I just haven't got the shot yet. Um, so I'm just kind of, I've been hearing them, so I just find them been coming out here when I hear them getting close to see which way they're coming. They tend to be all kind of floating over by the river right now. But anyways, uh, I'm not a big drinker, but Kristen and I picked up a six pack of stout beers. Just a random six pack. I'll run through them here. What do we got? We got Best Brown Ale. Well, that's an ale. That's probably hers. We got a Blue Moon Cappuccino Oatmeal Stout. Let's see, we got New Belgium 1554 Black Lager. We got Sierra Nevada West Coast Style Stout. An Obsidian Stout. And a Guinness Drought. So we'll drink those up tonight. Got about two hours left. Uh, until the roast is done, and I are just going to watch it some DVDs on the laptop. Walk in here, just kind of take a look. There they are. I don't know if you guys can see right there, but slamming the doors to the yurt. It's pretty windy out. Yeah, it gets a little dark in here, but that sunroof right there. Or that I don't know what you call that. What is that? A moonlight? Whatever. It's pretty, pretty nice. It'll be interesting. I don't think it's gonna be too clear to see any stars, but during the summer it'd be pretty cool. So that's what we got going on. You can definitely smell the stew down here cooking up. Smells great.